Welcome to the channel. Welcome to the vlog, Car Connections. Make sure you subscribe. So they say never drive this car in the rain because of the Sport Cup 2s it has. It is not designed for the rain, but I just left the office and uh, I had no other option but to drive the car in the rain. And so that's what we're doing right now. So far, so good. Just taking it easy. I mean, it's again, I'm, I'm using pretty much slicks right now. And again, they don't have, they're just they're not, they're not designed for rain and I get it. But I just want to post this real quick that she's getting all wet and uh, I'm driving her in the rain. Thing, you know, things are going to be okay, I think. I'm also uh, listening to some old school rap. I'm not sure if you guys are familiar with this. So I was an early 90s kid and uh, I grew up with nothing but but rap and hip hop, you know, and, and then I was I'm a local Houstonian. So rap a lot records was very, very famous growing up as a kid. So Ghetto Boys, Scarface, you name them, they were huge in Houston. Part of rap a lot records, uh, Ghetto Boys, Bushwick Bill, all those guys. But it's raining. Listening to some jams. Car's getting wet. Just enjoying the rain though. We haven't gotten rain in Houston in I don't know how long. So in a way it's okay that the car's getting wet. It just hasn't rained here. I'm gonna take it real easy. I think there's like a different type of suspension setting I can put on here, which I think it's designed for wet or slick roads. Maybe I should have done that. Um, just in case, dude, because it's, I'm not that confident driving this car right now in this type of weather. All right, guys, so stay close to the channel. I'll continue to post content. Just want to post this real quick because it's the first time, again, she's getting wet. And uh, I wanted to show you also a quick little walk up to my car as I leave the office. Uh, one of my buddies from work, he has a YouTube channel. You should re uh, visit him, Shots Automotive. He actually told me about this little spot where a lot of people don't park. So it's like the perfect spot where, you know, I can park my car and it won't probably get hit or dented. So regardless, you always run the risk, I get that, but it is less riskier to put it where I'm putting it at. Last thing I wanted to share with you guys before I close it out is I did get an email from the dealership in Austin to pick up my Mini SE. I've been waiting four and a half months for this car and so Again, as I mentioned before, I'm going to vlog that. So if you're interested in that, please stay tuned. We'll be picking up the Mini Cooper 2023 SE, meaning it's full electric. Range is about 100, 120 miles, which is the perfect amount for a commuter. And this car will be staying in the garage and just become a weekender. Uh, but that's it, guys. Stay tuned. Subscribe. Peace.